question? Have you heard about this exciting Norwegian startup? They've come up with a fantastic solution for photo and video enthusiasts that they call Viral. Imagine a compact cable system that allows you to share your visual stories in a whole new way. It's like a drone alternative, but with some unique perks. The Viral Lite version, for instance, operates quietly, can handle gear up to 1.2 kilograms, and lasts for a solid three hours before needing a recharge. Setting it up is a breeze, taking just about three minutes. And if you're looking for dynamic movement shots, this device can zip along at speeds up to 12.5 meters per second. All this for just $424. It's definitely worth checking out for anyone passionate about capturing stunning visuals. Hypershell. Imagine stepping into a world where natural limitations no longer hold you back. The creators of this remarkable exoskeleton invite you to venture deeper into forests, climb higher mountains, and challenge the limits of speed like never before. While it might not be as flashy as Tony Stark's suit, it comes with a surprisingly modest price tag of just $300. With this exoskeleton, you can enhance your efficiency at work, explore farther distances, and combat fatigue, thanks to its ability to support up to 30 kilograms of weight and cover 25 kilometers on a single charge. Need a burst of speed? You can zoom along at up to 20 kilometers per hour, enough to leave slowpoke hikers in the dust, or at least behind you. And the best part? The entire package, including two batteries, weighs just 2.4 kilograms, making it a lightweight powerhouse ready for your next adventure. Have you heard the latest from Motorola? At the Lenovo Tech World 2023, they unveiled something truly fascinating, a prototype of a flexible smartphone. Imagine a phone so bendable that you can wrap it around your wrist like a smartwatch. It's like getting two devices in one. No more need for a phone stand, and you can enjoy videos or messages hands-free. In its regular form, the screen boasts a generous 6.9-inch diagonal, but when bent, it shrinks down to a compact 4.6 inches. While we're not sure if this flexible wonder will hit the mass market soon, Motorola did showcase a similar concept back in 2016, hinting that someone at the company is quite keen on this innovative idea. Keep an eye out for more updates. It's an exciting time for smartphone tech. You know the West Coast Customs crew from Pimp My Ride, right? Well, imagine if they customize pools instead of cars, that's exactly what the Endless Pools company does. Now, it's tough to say who's cooler, but have you ever seen a pool with a built-in treadmill? Endless Pools takes pool customization to the next level by adding features like resistance current systems, exercise areas, and even hydro massage options. The workout experience in one of these pools is seriously impressive. Picture swimming 100 meters in just a minute and 14 seconds. That's a fantastic time even for seasoned swimmers. Plus, these pools are perfect for kids learning different swimming techniques. And here's a neat bonus. They have a proprietary app that acts as an electronic scoreboard, letting you check your results in real time. Just be prepared to invest around $30,000 for this incredible pool upgrade. Here's another fascinating development, a system that generates electricity from waves. The concept is quite straightforward, pressure fluctuations in the membrane cause air movements, which then rotate the turbine to generate power. And the results are impressive. During tests in Portugal, a 40 converter installation produced a whopping 60 megawatts of power. It's no wonder that the authorities are impressed too, as the team has already been invited to join the Europe Wave program, focused on wave energy. They've also received funding from the European Regional Development Fund, showcasing the growing interest and support for innovative renewable energy solutions. The Japanese have unveiled something truly remarkable, a massive walking robot about the size of a car. This giant, measuring 3.4 meters long, has the incredible capacity to comfortably carry four people. Interestingly, the company behind this creation specializes in amusement rides, and it's no surprise, given the sheer joy this robot named SR2 brings to both its passengers and onlookers. 
While it moves at a leisurely pace, it can perform impressive maneuvers like squatting, turning in one spot, and spreading cheer wherever it goes. Controlled remotely, it's not quite at the level of a Star Wars ad at Walker yet, but who knows? We might start seeing similar robots making appearances in amusement parks. And who can say what the future holds? Perhaps the next model will be even bigger and more awe-inspiring. For now, though many are already impressed by the SR2, standing tall at 1.9 meters. Here is something cool from Japan you might want to keep an eye on. Extra arms that can be attached to a special backpack. No need to go full Dr. Octopus here. The backpack can handle up to 6 arms, and the entire setup weighs just 15 kilograms. You can control these arms either using a joystick if you're wearing the backpack, or have them operated remotely by someone else. One arm per person makes it super versatile. What's neat is that, the system is modular, so you can swap arms with other backpack owners. Imagine the possibilities for professions like hairdressers, massage therapists, and construction workers. And who knows, maybe in the future, we'll see integration with neurocontrol technology. A strong base isn't just for parties and loud cars anymore, it can also help put out fires. Students from George Mason University in the US have developed a sound-based fire extinguisher. While the concept isn't entirely new, their version is compact and highly effective, successfully extinguishing burning alcohol in tests. The key is using sound frequencies between 30 and 60 Hz. What's even more impressive is that, the students only spent $600 on this project. They're looking into mounting these innovative fire extinguishers on drones, adding a whole new dimension to firefighting technology. C-Drone, a company specializing in remotely operated vehicles, is rolling out an enticing offer for ship owners. Their American-made underwater machines promise substantial time and cost savings, particularly during ship inspections and dry docks. By replacing traditional methods with certified underwater inspections, C-Drone claims to complete the process in just an hour, saving five to eight times the cost of hiring a dive team. Not only that, but these inspections also generate certified reports in PDF format, and their app provides ample photo and video materials. It's a tailored service aimed at meeting the needs of ship owners, delivering efficiency that saves both time and money. In the realm of bicycle culture, numerous events celebrate this eco-friendly mode of transportation, including the National Bike Summit. At this gathering, American cyclists were thrilled by the introduction of wave-shaped protective barriers. Though still in the test phase, these barriers exhibit great promise due to their straightforward installation and unique design. Functionally, they continue to serve the crucial role of safeguarding bicycle lanes from indiscriminate parking, while also aiding in the separation of car and bike lanes, a win-win for cyclists and urban planners alike. Matador, an American company, offers a compact stuff sack that's a game-changer for pool and beach enthusiasts. Priced at $17 and attachable to your keychain, this sack is perfect for keeping your essentials dry while you enjoy the water. Before diving in, stash your smartphone, wallet, and other moisture-sensitive items in the stuff sack. It's also great for storing wet swimwear like suits and trunks afterward. With a capacity of 2.5 liters and weighing just 23 grams, this sack is incredibly lightweight. Crafted from nylon with a silicone body, it's durable and includes a stainless steel component. All right, let's talk about Finnish company, uneven, and their deep dive into the world of esports. If you need proof, just check out the table they've co-designed, the Dota 2 Pro Player Jerks. This folding engineering marvel isn't your average table, it's equipped with a monitor and a fully functional computer, tailored specifically for gamers with top-notch hardware like the Ryzen 7 and the RTX 4070 Ti, along with a 27-inch monitor. However, quality comes at a cost, the table, measuring 114 by 68 centimeters without the monitor or other internal components, rings in at $1,200. 
Volvo has recently been putting their crash testing prowess to the test, especially in rescue training scenarios. They didn't hold back conducting dramatic crash tests that involved dropping tin cars from a towering height of 30 meters. But that's not all. They've been relentless in their efforts to improve car safety through various tests. However, when it comes to less extreme situations where cost efficiency is key, Volvo has developed an innovative solution. They use special vehicle targets, essentially mock-ups of the actual vehicles, needed for testing. These targets can be swiftly assembled on a specialized platform within minutes, and then accelerated to speeds of up to 100 km per hour. This method has proven ideal for testing unmanned systems, as these vehicle targets are adeptly detected by radar, infrared systems, and scanners, mimicking real-world scenarios and contributing significantly to the ongoing evolution of safety measures. According to data from analysts worldwide, people are spending around 4 to 5 hours daily glued to their smartphones, not to mention the usage of tablets gaming systems like the Steam Deck and various other devices. This means many individuals are spending prolonged periods in positions that strain their necks, especially with tilted heads. At a 15 degrees angle, the neck can bear a load of about 12 kilograms, which can lead to discomfort and pain. Recognizing this issue, the American team at XNEC has introduced an exercise machine to address it. Regular use of this device improves blood circulation, strengthens neck muscles, and reduces the risk of neck pain. Priced at $100, this device is a worthwhile investment for anyone looking to alleviate neck strain and discomfort caused by prolonged device usage. Virtual reality and augmented reality gadgets aren't just for gamers anymore. They have practical applications in various industries, including factories. A U.S. company has introduced specialized gloves tailored for corporate clients. These gloves utilize compressed air technology and hundreds of micro-actuators to simulate the sensation of touching virtual objects, matching their size and texture to create a more immersive experience. They are compatible with software platforms like Unreal Engine and Unity, and can even be fine-tuned for those familiar with C++. Available in four universal sizes, the power supply for these gloves can be conveniently carried in a backpack. However, these high-tech gloves come with a price tag of $5,500, along with an additional subscription fee. Have you heard of Project Silica? It's a groundbreaking technology that stores data in quartz glass wafers, and yes, it's not just from a sci-fi movie, it's a real invention developed by Microsoft. Imagine, a small 75 by 75 by 2 mm quartz plate can hold up to a whopping 75.6 gigabytes of data. They use lasers to create intricate three-dimensional patterns to record and retrieve data. What's more, they've developed an AI-based system to manage this data effectively. These quartz plates are incredibly durable, able to withstand scratches, magnetic fields, and even boiling temperatures. Plus, the data stored on them can last for approximately 10,000 years. Microsoft envisions using these plates in cloud servers, revolutionizing data storage as we know it. All right, let's wrap up today's lineup with a Swiss system. Have you heard about the latest in drone technology? Some websites are calling it the Flying F1 Bullet. And honestly, it's not too far from the truth. This man drone is a powerhouse, packing a whopping 220 horsepower and reaching mind-blowing speeds of up to 140 km per hour. They took this beast for a serious spin, even bringing in Mira Costasina, a multiple DSL drone racing champion, to showcase its capabilities. Trust me, it was a sight to behold as he pulled off impressive turns, barrel rolls, and flips, giving us a sneak peek into what future races might look like. Who knows, we might see it rivaling F1 in NASCAR. And if you're itching to experience the thrill of piloting, you can give it a try with the official DSL drone racing game.